What's up guys, Nivog here, and uh, today I'm going to be making a video that I never really thought I would be ever really making. <laughs> um, yeah, Techie, they did it this year, for sure, they did it. Today is July 17th, it's only 12.01 a.m., and uh, I'm going to be talking about some of the uh, some of the animatronics that Techie has uh, returned. On Haunted Hill Farm, out of all places, you would think maybe Spirit... Or, you know, somewhere else. But no, Haunted Hill Farm. <laughs> they did it this year. Oh my goodness. Um, wow. Well, from what I'm looking at, you guys are probably like, oh, if you ha if you haven't known about what's uh, what's been going on, um, I'll just scroll down a little bit. Yep, that's, that's what's happening. Mm -hmm. This is what's happening. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, let's get into this. So, oh my goodness. I'm so happy about this. Um, yeah, Techie brought some of the, the classics out. They, uh, they're like, all right, let's go through the shed and get some classic props out. Except these are going to be brand new this year, which is going to be really exciting. Brand new, fresh new. Um, it's honestly amazing. As you can see, um, well, they have like Rusty and nobody really cares about that too much. Uh, some people do, but, um, they're also bringing this guy back. Um, not many people really care about him. So what I want to look at is all these ones from uh, the ancient times. <laughs> all right, so um, I guess we'll start off with Thrashing Clown first because um, this is one that I definitely, well, I, I'm, I don't know, I just can't believe it. They really did it this year. I mean, with Spirit, like, we all thought Pumpkin Nester is gonna, was going to return and some other ones were going to return, like Barnyard Butcher, Pumpkin Nester, and they never did unfortunately and they brought back out of all props grave watcher even though she's kind of cool and stuff it's just i just don't understand <laughs> it's i don't know anyways um let's go ahead and look at thrashing clown which hasn't he has a name now apparently stanley the thrashing clown um i don't know how i feel about that but um yeah in the description right here it says uh partnering with techie toys a leader in premium halloween animatronics we bring you our Back from the Dead collection. And I'm not going to read... I'm going to stop there. You can read the rest if you want. Um, so apparently he has a name. I think this looks like the new model to me. Um, looks a little different. Um, but he does look pretty cool though, I must say. <laughs> I mean, the face looks the exact same, but the clothing looks a little bit different. He has less blood on him, which is really cool, but... One thing about these props that it, that just like blew my mind on this site was the price. Like he was one seventy nine, which would have been a pretty good deal even for this guy. Um, but one twenty seven is is absolutely like wow. <laughs> you know, it's super affordable. Um, at least in uh, this around this time, super affordable. You know. I always, you know, you always see these props on eBay. They go for like hundreds of dollars and um, they're always broken. There's always an issue with them. And people, you know, are willing to spend hundreds of dollars because that's the only way you could ever really purchase these guys nowadays. Um, so it's really cool that Techie finally brought this guy back um, and all these other props. Um, I'm really excited to see Thrashing Clown. Um, and uh, you're probably wondering, will I be purchasing any of these animatronics? Well, if they look great and uh, if there's no uh, problems with them, and he's actually in stock now. No way. Oh my God, I didn't even realize that. He's now in stock. That's crazy. Sorry, I'm just taking a sip of water. Um, and uh, here, I'll look at Lurching Vampire next because Res Resurrection Mary, uh, I don't know. I really have too many. Uh, I don't, not really, don't really like her that much. Um, I mean, she's cool, but, you know, um, now this is something that I've wanted for a very long time. Lurching Vampire. He was 189, but now he's 135. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, I think he has a name, too. Let me, let me see here. Does he have a name? Uh, it probably says it somewhere. I think he does. I don't know. Um, but, yeah. Oh yeah, right, it's right here. Let me see. Cornelius. Now, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, it's kind of cool that they have names now. But, um, yeah. As you can see, this is not the uh, 2023 model. Um, this is the, you know, the 20... 
10 model that was, you know, they just printed it on there. But this is really cool. I, I hope, you know, these animatronics turn out well. I heard they're going to be pretty much the exact same. Hopefully they're built better because I know some of these guys were very faulty. And I know even in 2011, they kind of um, fixed up Lurching Vampire because in 2010 he was super faulty and he had a bunch of issues. The 2011, the other later models, they had issues as well, but it wasn't as bad as, you know, um, the 2010 model. And I also heard for Spirit, I'm not sure if it's for Spirit or it's for Haunted Hill Farm, but I heard that they're going to bring back uh, Demonica as well. Um, I'm not 100% because I don't know if that's a rumor or not, but I heard it's possible that Haunted Hill Farm or Spirit, I don't know which, I forgot which one, but that they might bring back Demonica and uh, if they do, that it's gonna be really, that's gonna be a really good seller for sure, because a bunch of people really want Demonica. Um, I already have a Demonica, so I'm probably not gonna get another one. Um, and mine, you know, so far it works pretty good. Um, it only has like one issue, but uh, yeah. Anyways, Lurching Vampire, I'm definitely gonna be getting him if uh, if you know everything works out. I'm gonna wait for uh, some people to get him first. Uh, so that way, you know, but he's out of stock. Now they have more. If you scroll, scroll down right here, they have Lunging Lily, Jacko Lunger. I mean, they're Lurching Reaper out of all props, <laughs> the Lurching Reaper. That's crazy. Um, let's take a look at Lunging Lily. Uh, I'll explain what my thoughts are on Jacko Lunger in a little bit, but Lunging Lily is another one that, you know, um, back, you know, in 2014 with the Attic, my favorite one out of all three of, uh, Broken Spine Girl, uh, Peek Boo Penny, and Lunging Lily was probably Lunging Lily, to be honest. Um, I liked Broken Spine Girl, but I knew she had issues and stuff. The concept was pretty cool, but I think I, I just liked Lunging Lily because she was probably the creepiest one because her audio was really creepy, you know, especially when she's like, you know, on that speaker phone, <laughs> it's kind of creepy, and then... All those demonic sounds, you know, that's really creepy. Now this one, I think I saw a photo of it. Um, somebody posted on Instagram, they posted a photo of the new model, um, which looks pretty cool. She looks a little bit more, a little cheap, to be honest, but she looks pretty cool. And that probably was a prototype, so it might look, you know, better. Now this one, yeah, this is really cool. 127. See, these, I mean... People have been selling them for uh, like $400, $400, $600 on eBay, and they're all broken and stuff like that. So it's just definitely not worth, especially for, you know, people who don't have any money, don't have much money and they're, you know, um, younger and they probably, you know, want something and their parents are never going to spend hundreds of dollars on one animatronic. So, you know, it's pretty cool that they have, you know, that this happened. Pretty much. Um, I do apologize if I kind of sound a little bit tired. Um, I know it may sound like I have act energy, but I'm, I'm just, I'm a little exhausted. Uh, let's take a look at Jack Lunger here. Sorry, taking a sip of water. Um, now, what are my thoughts on Jack Lunger uh, returning? Um, he was, I, I like him a lot. I think he's really cool. Um, he was never really my favorite. Um, and I don't really remember him ever really being that recognized back in 2014. People kind of recognize Lil Nestor and Pumpkin Nestor way more um, around that time. Not really jack o -Lunger. jack o was never really that much of, he wasn't really a popular sale back in yeah 2014. At least from the locations I went to around that time. Uh, he wasn't really that great of a seller and, you know, he never returned. So that it kind of made sense why, you know, um, but I think he is really cool. And, uh, will I be getting him? I'm not sure. I, I do want to get the Lurching Vampire, Lunging Lily and uh, Thrashing Clown. I might get Jack O'Lunger at some point. I might wait until next year to get him. Um, but we'll see. Uh, I don't want to like dump all my money at the, you know, <laughs> one time, but I don't know, I might do it uh, for the other ones. We'll see, we'll see. Now, this one's really cool. I think this is the new model as well, you can tell that, but he looks really cool. Um, I hope these these ones have good audio. I know um, 
you know, their audio on the other older models are not really that great. But hopefully, you know, uh, they turn out well. Let's look at um, Lurching Reaper. Lurching Demon Reaper. Now, he uh, he's basically a Lurching Vampire reskin, um, except, you know, his mouth doesn't open. He's a Reaper. He lunges forward. Uh, he's really cool. I don't really have much to say about him, but, you know, the price is amazing. 135 Yeah, um, they really did it this year. This is, I'll be honest, a little more, slightly more exciting than what Spirit has released. I do like Spirit's lineup this year. I think it's very exciting, but this kind of takes the cake, to be honest. Um, because it's kind of, the techie, you know, well, you know, I'll be honest. I mean, I gotta wait, because there, you know, might be some things that go wrong with this this whole thing. Like, some of them might be broken, some of them not, might not look right, and that probably is gonna happen with a few of them, but hopefully not all of them. So I really can't be talking, and I also have not seen any of Spirit's uh, new animatronics in person yet, so I can't really speak on that either. Um, but we'll see, we'll see, and I'll make up, I'll give you guys my full um, answer eventually. But uh, yeah, this is really cool. Um, let's see here. What else do we got? I think that might be it. Um, now there's also other animatronics on here, like, you know, that werewolf from Home Depot. And uh, I don't even remember that <laughs> at all. Um, anyways, yeah, that's really all I have to uh, explain in this video. I'm just kind of, that's really all I have to uh, say. Let's take a look at Resurrection Mary. Oh my god, $75. <laughs> uh, there's probably uh, shipping included in, in some of these and, and you know, uh, with tax and stuff like that. So um, keep in mind. But um, I think she's pretty cool. She's not really my, my favorite, but um, it is nice that they uh, are bringing her back because I know there's a little fan base for her. But yeah, that's uh, honestly really cool. Yep. All right. Well, um, I guess I'll be in the end of this video. <laughs> I know I apologize. I'm making this very quickly, but uh, yeah, and they're bringing back these, uh, this one right here. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Um, I'm really uh, inter like when I found out about this, I didn't believe it all. I, I, one of my friends was telling me about it, and I'm like, "There's no way. There's there's got to be no way." But um. I guess it's true. I mean, I'll make a video talking about how I feel about the the new models when people actually make videos of them, and I'll give you guys my, my thoughts about that um, in the future. Uh, I don't know how long these uh, props are going to be out of stock for. I know, I just realized, yeah, that Thrashing Clown's in stock now, so uh, we'll see. But yeah, guys, this is really cool. Um, anyways, yeah, I'm gonna end the video right here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, leave a comment, and let me know what your thoughts are uh, for these returns. You know, it's crazy because I've, you know, I haven't seen most of these animatronics ever, ever since. Um, so this is very exciting. Anyways, guys, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, and uh, yeah, very exciting for 2023. Good start. All right, see you guys in the next video, and remember, stay vlogging.